here at Mid-Ocean Club, top 100 course in the world, Charles Blair McDonald, uh, it's Pro-Am for the Bermuda Championship with my, my boys at Goslings, with Robbie, Malcolm Jr., Malcolm Sr. You know how we do these videos, try to break 80. Come out here, bring us a five handicap. A good round, I can break 80, a bad round, you know, I shoot 85, and an average round, I shoot, you know, 81, 82. Uh, we're here as a team. We're probably going to have a couple cocktails and try to win this thing. And you guys are going to get to see Mid-Ocean, which is a spectacular, historic course with a lot of templates. So enjoy it. I love Liberty now. Welcome you to the Mid-Ocean Club. Iconic logo. Uh, it's a pleasure to have you here. Today. We look forward to uh, doing this year and year after again. One of the best logos Before we send you back out, we're going to know the rules and we'll pass this over to Justin. This thing's only about birdies, pretty much? Is that what yeah, doing? that's birdies all it's about. Okay. Anything more than that, par's your friend, according to Robbie. Wow. I would say gross par, not net par, right? I have no idea. What, do you have to hit a draw over the tree? Yeah, with this Right. Wait, like well, John, is it all four balls, or what is it? We our own ball, and we use the best score. Best ball, that's the best ball. Sure. Oh, yeah. Thank you. So, the situation is 6,100 yards, mid ocean. It's probably a 10, 15 mile an hour wind out here, which is a joke. It doesn't even count. Uh, a lot of tough tee shots out here, a lot of blind tee shots. But we keep hitting that three wood like we're hitting him, we're gonna play, we're gonna just embarrass this ball. Boom. Where'd that go? In the bunker? Two oh nine, a little downhill, a little downwind. I got a five iron. Aim at the right edge of the green and just draw this puck. Great try. Thank you. Appreciate it. Yeah, it's okay. What am I supposed to do? Pin in the back. I was telling Junior, I've been playing the last couple of months, I've been playing some of the best golf.
Go ahead, Mal. I need a minute to myself. Here. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> That's the new driver, right? New shaft. New shaft. Put a brand new shaft in it. That wasn't a great swing, and it went pretty straight, so I'm pretty confident in this shaft now. Last one was too much. It was called the Hulk, and I just couldn't. I wasn't swinging well. I just hit everything way out to the right because I couldn't keep up with it. This thing is much better. We got 221 flag, but it's, it's a cool hole. It goes up and then runs down towards the hole. So really, I got a three iron. If I can just even hit it low and just run something up there, even if we're 30 or 40 yards short, because I don't know how it's going to come out of this rough. Is this Bermuda rough? Oh, yeah. We're in Bermuda. All right, this is going to sound crazy, but I clubbed down two clubs. The reason is this. Uh, I want something more loft. I think it could fly out of here. They said it's either going to come fly out of here or it's going to come out completely dead. And if it flies and I was hitting the three iron, it's just going to go way over the green. So I think if I get a jumper with the five iron, I can get it there. But I don't hate being short. Short's fine. Mm. We're about, we're just short of pin high, which shows a right club. We're on the road, so we get a free drop. Closer to the hole, we're on the road like there. You know, it's got this giant mound. That's just kind of what we were facing. So if you get it on top of that, it would kind of skid all the way down towards the hole. But uh, we're over here, we got a pretty straightforward chip. Chipped in last year. Dude, this is the hole that they had to. They have couldn't even up play. There. Yeah. Dude, I hit a chip that I thought was like okay, and it ended up just never stopped, and then was rolling like backwards and went into the hole. <laughs> <laughs> That's great. All right, 123 bass. We got uh, a little uphill. I think wind's slightly helping, but mostly out of the left. You can see that pin. Zoom in on that pin up there. Thing is humming to the left. Absolutely humming. I draw the ball, so it could be dicey. I'm gonna hit a pitching wedge and just try to try to hold one up a little. I'm part of the green. Thought the wind was gonna take it. Bass, you got water out there, my friend. A nice teal water, and then it and then it hits the contrast into the dark blue water. That is that is beautiful. That's what Bermuda hit. That's what it don't. Shot there, Mal. I got a three iron straight into the wind. Playing pretty fucking well, I gotta be honest. Just sling a draw from the right center. Thank 
Yep. All right, folks, um, last time we played this hole, we made a 10 to shoot 100. So, looking for something better here. Oh. Yeah, good hit. Fine, right? Hell yeah. Better than I did last time. Great shot. That guy, that guy's at most cool houses. Al, what do you Great got? shot. Right, man. Oh, what do you got? What a shot. Yeah. Marzino. <laughs> Nine? Nine, yeah. Okay. Take that right now, boys. Yeah, absolutely. <laughs> a little rainy, a little windy. All right, Bass, we got 155 uphill into the wind. Wind kind of died. I mean, it's fucking pouring. We just took like 10 minutes off. It's pouring. Uh, I got a seven iron. This is what we're looking at. This is the shot we're looking at. Pretty awesome. It's worth you guys walking up here with me. Um, it's gonna be a little right to left chip because the wind, the wind's gonna take it. If you miss left, you're gone. A little false front situation. We're gonna try to land it out there about five feet right. Get up and down. Stay two over par. Rained on us, poured on us, we stopped, as windy as hell, hard hole to begin with. I got out of there with a bogey. We'll take that and we will cruise. about uh, 80 yards the pin uphill into the wind play about a 95 90 93 yard shot 
I think there's a little room behind it, Ethan. No. I got 54 degree wedge. I got a seven iron there, James. Look at that rainbow though. Yeah. Gorgeous. I mean this place is unlike I mean we're in we're in the middle of the Atlantic Ocean. That's just like that's just what happened. Yeah. So it's you know, it pours on you. Outrageous. Perfect storm situation and then two seconds later there's a rainbow and it's beautiful out. So it's just a weird place. Thank you. Alright bass, we got uh 124 flag uphill. I think the wind is uh, straight into. It's hard to tell down here. We're a little below it, but I think it's straight into. So I call it a 135 shot. I got a nine iron. I think it's nice, solid, smooth nine iron right at it.
take that on this hole. It's a tough hole. That was a huge par on this hole. I think this is the last really tough hole. Not the same. I mean, we're our skill level for a reason. Every hole is kind of tough, but uh, that was huge. I think there's a couple birdie opportunities now. We're uh, six over. We've got five or six holes left. So good golf. We should be fine. All right, we got 85 yard, downhill lie, pins in the middle of the green. I got a 58 degree wedge, about my, you know, probably hit my, about my 80 yard club. Uh, should be a pretty simple wedge. Oh my God. Oh my God. I took a horrible bounce to the right. Yeah. Our wedges, I think I'm 0 for 2 hitting the green with wedges. All right, so we landed right up by where you're standing there, Bass, and just got rejected, you call that. So we got a bad lie, we're buried here. At 54 degree, I'm gonna kind of hit an inch behind it like a bunker shot on us. Accelerate, get this puppy up on the green and roll. Pitching wedge. This is, uh, I think you just gotta go right at it. Boys need birdies. Sixty yards. I got a uh, fifty-eight degree wedge. Thank you. Slow coming this way, very fast going that way. Okay. Good move. So I did see it on the card. It's a uh, par 71 or 7 over. We have one stroke that we can still give away. But I'd like to finish strong 77. I mean, Yeah, that's a lot. Oh, this is 
had a horrific lot. Seven over now. No, eight over now. So through 16 holes, we got two holes left, 10 and 11, and we got to play them at uh, even par. Thirty-two. We got a uh, pitching win. I think it should be a perfect. One. All right. All right. Thank you. It's pretty go a long way. Eight over on the uh, 12th or 11th tee, which is our final hole, 451 yard par five. So tell me, just sling driver over that tree, a little draw, and it should be really, really good. Go zone. A lesser man would probably lay up, be a little bitch, and make his par and get out of here. But I, I want to make equal and shoot 77. Driver. Our target, but it draw. It drew. It, it, it drew. It drawed. It drew. It drew. Yep. All right, Bass. We got uh, 199 flag. We got 182 to the front edge. I got a five iron to try to hack something low that runs up that front edge if it skips into the middle of the green. Great shot. Fine position. Here we are on a uh, par five. We've got 60 yards to pin. Pretty, all things considered, we're fine. Um, simple little wedge shot. Be aggressive. Try to make bird. Team needs bird. 58 degree wind. Here we go. Pretty damn good. Looks really good. At that for 78. Bit of weird round. All right, Bass, so we're walking up to the uh, final green of the day. We probably got a 10 footer, so it looks like for uh, 78. So we're probably shooting 78 or 79. It's been a weird round. It was windy as hell at times. It was very calm at times. It was pouring rain at times. Um, it's just been a weird round. Played from 6,100 yards. That's just the format. We're here for the Am Am. And, uh, we battled through a lot of adversity. We do. We have about 10 feet for a birdie for 78. It's a pretty decent call. Thank you. We did it. Great round, boys. Lots that was fun. fun. Lots of fun. That was a great time. Awesome. Absolute awesome. blast as Thanks always. Thanks a lot, man. Good birdie. Nice awesome. finish. Thanks. Nice finish, bro. Senior? Hey, well played, mate. That was fun. Very yeah, fun. well played. Thank God that curled in. 79. We'll take it. All right. Almost three putted there, but we shot 79. Look, I can only play the course that I can play. Come for the Am Am format with the Gosling's guy. 
Bermuda, Bermuda Championship. I can only play the course as presented to me and shoot the best score that I can. I would have liked it to have been lower, 6,100 yards, but Charles Blair McDonald, tricky son of a bitch, a lot of blind tee shots, wind, rain, all kinds of stuff happening. We shot 79. That's decent, girl.